What's up guys, today I'm showing you the Windows Phone 7 theme on an iPhone 4. This theme was released a little while ago by Ganman, and well, let's get started. Right here I have an iPhone 4 running iOS 4.1 and it's jailbroken. On the back is the iPhone 4 case that I received from the case program a little while ago. And alright, so let's check out the lock screen. So this right here is the Windows Phone 7 lock screen. The lock screen is absolutely amazing. The background image complements the Retina display very well. And it just gives you that full effect of a Windows Phone. And also it gives you a little taste of what's inside. So let's check it out. And this right here is my own edition of the Android lock. Alright, so now we have the user interface. The user interface has the full feature tiles and it just feels very nice. It gives you all the features that you would get in a Windows Phone 7 and it overall looks really, really nice. Um, all these tiles, they are uh, live tiles as in meaning that uh, that if there's an update to anything in that, in that specific app, it will show up as if it would in a Windows Phone and it won't show up as a little red badge or a little red button. So like right there for the Windows Phone... Uh, it would say marketplace but for an iPhone it says app store my app store says that I have 11 updates and that's why it shows 11 at the top and otherwise the whole user interface it looks very nice and as you can see right there that's my live clock um, the actual seconds hand is moving and I decided to keep its color different than anything else and also the photos um, tile I'm customizing right now as you can see it's sh uh, size is a little off but soon I'll have it all good to go so let's check out the second page. This is a second page. Um, it looks exactly like the Windows Phone 7. It's fully featured as uh, I was in the Windows Phone 7, and it just looks amazing. It gives you that full feel of a, a Windows Phone, and I mean, <laughs> how many times do you, can you not say that it just looks really, really nice? And also these arrows, they actually work. As you can see right there, it took me to my lock info. Right. Uh, the lock info just gives you um, all your calendar, your mail, notification, missed calls, voicemail, SMS, etc. Whatever is important to you. And you can also set it up so that the lock info shows up uh, when you go to the lock screen. So let's check out the keyboard now. This right here is the keyboard that comes with the theme. The keyboard is actually really nice looking. But however, I did not like actually using it because it was a little harder to type on. And it just wasn't feeling right whenever I used it. Um, the normal keyboard I like a lot better, but I mean, overall, the keyboard looks re very nice and fits the theme very well. And also, for phone, as I said, like I was saying before, that, um, the theme, uh, the theme fits in the keyboard, the keypad as well, and it just looks really nice. And here I will show you, um, just the responsiveness of the tiles. So like that, the tiles are very responsive. They show you, they uh, react ex like right away, and overall, they just basically work very nice. These are just uh, the folders that were to be made from the themes for your games, and I mean overall it. You become basically the envy of your friends. It looks very nice. It feels very nice. And it just gives you that overall really, really nice handle on the Windows Phone. And now I'll just show you the uh, music player. It's right there. The actual buttons actually, they look very nice and they, well, obviously they work. And it just gives you that same feel of a Windows Phone. And... In my next in my next video, I will show you um, how to in install this and make it look exactly how like, how it does on mine. So stay tuned. Peace out, guys. Low, low, low. Telling everybody that I know we about to be on, 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 on. I ain't trying to look like a lie to these niggas that I came up with. That's my team.